Hey everyone, Lensman Oz and Chilled here again. We're back in MF2. We're just jumping around worlds all over the place. Oh yeah, oh yeah, everywhere but here. <laughs> all right, the pack has had an update. So thanks to Golroth for doing an update and then teasing us with refined storage and not having it available. But um, yeah, he... there's some stuff that he's heading towards and um, it's it's not ready yet. Let's put it that way. It, it, it's a tease, um, and it, it's it's not ready yet. But uh, looking in the in the book here, there's a whole bunch of stuff that has been uh, added. So we've got these this laser theory stuff, and then teleportation portals. Uh, the ring of magnetizing is now a research you have to do. Um, and what else is there? There's down in space. Space has been uh, expanded a bit. Um, and there's a lot of stuff. Some of it still isn't ready. He, he, he's not ready to do some of the rocket things yet. But it's definitely starting to um, starting to, to build out for the ability for us to visit other planets. And you've got some uh, some quests here to actually visit other planets. Uh, under where is it? Automation. Um, Xnet has been removed, um, and and as I said, going to refine storage. Uh, we've got laser drills and quarries for the mark uh, marker quarries for the, the the quarry plus mod, which is our first burner and electric drills. Uh, actually from the Quarry Plus mod, which should allow us to do some pretty intensive um, flattening of the environment. <laughs> Let's put it that way. We may break Aussie's server doing it. Um, heavy radiation shielding's now in, and I believe the hazmat suit as well. So that's something we probably need to push towards, which actually I can un... Oop, I didn't mean to click that one. I should be able to unlock that now. Um, and hopefully... Hopefully, we'll be okay for doing production yellow. Only downside at the moment after the update is that the radiation settings are broken again and we need to chew right away like it's candy. Fun stuff. Or throw yourself off a bread off the top, but that doesn't last long. <laughs> Not long enough. Uh, so I needed another 22 production blue. They are underway. They should be getting there soon. I need 100 yellow. So let me unlock... Oh, I've got 80. 80 yellow, sorry. Let me unlock heavy radiation shielding. I think that's what I was going for. Is that what I was going for for yellow? One quick check before I go and click on the button. Uh, Advanced Electronics 3. Not really super interested in that. This one was 250 yellow and... And the chests are here. Right, so I do need to unlock this. We're going to need 250 yellow, but for the moment, I do believe it's probably better for us to get shielding. And then work back up towards the 250 yellow. So I'm going to unlock shielding. Um, so that will be heavy radiation shielding, and then we should be able to unlock um, the hazmat suit. Do I have? I've got 49 nuclear research in there. Can I get one more nuclear research, please? There's our 22 production blue that we need for 100. Um, so we'll be able to get... I don't know if you want to start working on the heavy radiation plating. Heavy right. plating is just another assembly machine. Now uh, We should have some tier 3 assemblers around. I have the blueprint on me if you like. Okay. Oh, nope. Oh. Your ring's off, isn't it? Oh, there we go. Try that. There you go. Uh, so that you should be able to request a, a level 3, tier 3 assembler in the system. Alright. Yeah, I'm a little behind. It's been a while <laughs> since I've been able to log into... Matter of fact, yo, you've done an awful lot. No, haven't done a lot at all. It's all in your head. Uh, I just need that one. Okay, so production blue, I am going to unlock production yellow science. Okay. 
The reason for unlocking this one, there's a couple of reasons. One, we need it for different areas of things here, but that... Hello? Hello, where is it? It's under logistics. Ender chests. You don't actually unlock ender chests. You buy them. So it takes 100 production yellow research and 50 white research, and you get two ender chests. But that alone will pretty much remove the need for us to have these cannons, the, the rail guns, and I should be able to massage my numbers teleporting between the two bases a lot better than what I currently can with with the rail guns. So that, that's where I'm pushing. I'm pushing, <laughs> pushing towards that pretty hard. Uh, there's our last nuclear research. Combine it with this 49. Let's go back to nuclear and unlock the hazmat suit. Nice. So the hazmat suit, so as, as I started to look there, the, the heavy plating is medium, some boron dust, and some carbon plate. Which I semi-automated early on, but I think I've disconnected it again. So we may just need to um, re reconnect this thing in here. Wherever it is, there's a squeezer in here somewhere, this one. Over near the, um, over near the, 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 the things, the sieve things. Um, yep, this squeezer was all set up to do coke dust into carbon. That's all right. It'll be a, a reconnect when we get a moment. I mean, I could reconnect it now, but it uses a lot of carbon. All right, so hazmat suit. Let me just check what that costs to build. Uh, so the hazmat suit will take a leather cap two heavy, heavy radiation shielding, and two plastic sheets. So it's actually pretty pretty cheap. <laughs> I say that, Gulroth's going to do something with it. Oh, he, he, he loves changing things up. It's, 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 it's cheap enough. Let's put it that way. Both recipes are the same uh, between the two different mods. Oh, this one takes medium. So, oh, that, why are there two different hazmats? Hazmat suit. They're both called hazmat suits. Well, I mean, we're wearing one. Yeah, but the next one's called a hazmat suit too from Nuclear Craft, mm -hmm. and the one we're wearing is the Tech Guns one, I think. Yes. So the next one we need to make uses heavy radiation shielding. Maybe it needs to be renamed to heavy hazmat suit. Anyway. That's fine. I'm going to put this away for the moment. Uh, heavy radiation shielding and go in here too and that one and the bar plan is here uh, okay I think I've just broke something excellent I love hearing that um, what'd you break somehow I made an assembler disappear did you pick it up I did. did you right click before left clicking? No, I I turned the assembler into a chest. I shift right clicked it on the chest so that it locked it, and then I loaded it and uh, assembler three disappeared. Okay, talent. Uh, yeah, I can see that something up there is a bit broken. Let's head upstairs and have a look. Maybe that was the last one I placed, so it kind of picked it back up. <laughs> I'm I'm trying to put it back down, but I don't have a block to set in the middle. Hang on. About that. You'll need to. Yep. Don't do it again. Oh. <laughs> it, it, it's the lag. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, but I think we may have lost. Or did I even has is this one I, even set up? I don't know. All I know oh, is Oh yes it is. Uh aluminum wire, aluminium wire, purified copper wire. What else is in this one? Tungsten plate. 
so wire. You just picked it up again. Yeah. yeah I, I, why is it doing that? I don't know. Talent. That is the industrial battery bank. So it'll need an R22 uh, recipe in it, which we would have lost. Okay. Um, I think I just put an R22 in the the chest. The <laughs> plans chests. So. Um... That was that was expensive. Do you want to? Yeah, here. <laughs> Throw it to me, and I'll try. All right. Symbol three. That chest. Linked to that chest. Is there stuff in it? Yes. There is that stuff in it. Yes. So I left clicked it and loaded it. There you go. All right. So. Try that again. Loaded. Come on, Maggie, pick it up. Saying it's just a, I'm not seeing the, the thing. Perfect. Okay. <laughs> Perfect. All right. I couldn't, I'll go I get couldn't the, see the wireframe even, you know. <laughs> we'll go and get the R22 and put it back in that other chest, in, in that other assembler. Uh, but yeah, so that'll be for heavy plating. Grab an R. 22 because we don't need two of them and I'll pop it in that other one and that will I don't know it probably voided a few materials there yeah probably so put this back in here not enough energy so maybe I hadn't even hooked it up because it doesn't even have a power connector on top and I don't have a connector in my inventory so no if it was a wireless one it would have just stayed there So perhaps I hadn't even finished hooking that guy up. Not the end of the earth. Now it's got a power. Now that one's got power. Now your one has power. Thank you. <laughs> what did I put in this one? That one has aluminium wire. What else does aluminium wire get used for? Oh yeah, industrial battery bank and lithium batteries. Anyway, that's cool. It's fine. All right, so what am I doing? I am working towards yellow research, so this will just need to go into a lab. Do I have a spare spot in a lab or do I need a new lab? Uh, what have you got? You have only got two. But will this cause problems? Uh, I think it will cause problems. Because yellow... Yes, it will. So this actually needs to go probably in the first one. Uh, what have we got in this one? Might be just quicker to make another lab, I think. Sounds like a plan. I think I have one more lab made. Whee. All right. Do I have a lab? The sworn. That I had made one at some point. What's right, we'll have. Nope. Nope. Just assembly machines. It's fine. What's a lab worth? No. Oh. Lab worth to make. Iron gears, circuit ones, and conveyors. Easy. Iron gears, circuit one, layers, don't use many of them anymore. Okay, uh, a chest and our red plan, so we'll make another lab, and then we will get 
some more bits and pieces connected to that. So where are my gears coming from? Timber two. Lab package, very nice. And all these things back to where they came. Go back to whence you came. Um, oh, the other thing that Gulrith's done is change up the reward system. <laughs> Not super happy about it. Um, it's fine. Like, need to bring my lab thing. Um, he's now made it so that to do the challenges to unlock the rewards here, you actually have to supply a thousand red signs and then a thousand green, and then a thousand orange, and a thousand blue, etc, etc. Um, you can spend a hundred coins and get into pouches, which is cool. Um, but yeah, you need to pay for the unlocks. Uh, so what I did here is I made another one of those screens, and just put a rigid request logistics pipe on the back here. And then every now and then I'll come over and type in red and request another 64 red science. And it will um, input it into the screen directly. Okay. <laughs> Which, yeah, isn't super fun. Because I don't have a high-speed crafting on my red science. Which probably wouldn't hurt, right? <clears throat> uh, lab. 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 Where is my blueprint for a lab? There it is. Okay. Let's build another lab. How are you going with the shielding there? Shield? Uh, should be. Not sure. I'm thinking. Uh, do you have um carbon plate being made? Yeah, I, I said before that's something I had made and then disconnected. Ah. Uh, so it is. It's still down there. I just gotta. Just gotta put a plate. Uh, I don't. It makes carbon ingots. I don't think it's making plates. So we may need a press. Okay. Uh, hooked up for it, but um, all I need to do is take an unrouted pipe and reconnect it, and we should be good. We should have a bunch of it, actually. Okay. It's this. It's this one here. Um, I just put a pipe in, Oop. and that will start producing uh, producing the thing again. I should be requesting some coke dust. Here it comes. Makes quite a bit of power. And makes the hop graphite dust. So hop graphite dust just needs to go through a blast furnace. To become hop uh, the ingot thing. So we've probably got... I might be able to do the request over here. So if we set up... Should be this logistics chassis over here should probably be able to do it. We can put another crafting module in here. So I can do that if you like. Uh, yeah. Um. And then it'll be a request craft. It won't, you know, it won't go nuts. Oh, uh, it'll it'll request it and do it for us. Well, like I said, the only thing left is the carbon plate, and then the the heavy shielding will be done. Crafting it's hooked up and ready. Module. One second. That one will need carbon. Oh, hop graphite, I should say. Uh, takes one hop graphite in. Get what this one's called. Oop, could have done it in here. Uh, blast furnace, good. What's that one? I don't know why I did that. My bad. We'll select this to blast furnace. And then we will get a hot graphite ingot out. Nice. And then we can potentially. It's the satellite logistics pie. This is a crafting. Okay. So what I could potentially do is another crafting. Hmm. Yeah, uh, probably want to. Right? 
Yeah, you probably just want to make another right. um, press somewhere and have it doing yeah. it automatically. And it will then just craft as it needs to. And we'll just have it as a crafting one. Um, actually, you know what? We'll, we'll use this. Don't, don't worry about it. Let me uh, make sat satellite or pipe called. Quest press. Let me grab a pipe out of my bag of tricks here. Wherever logistics <laughs> chassis. Start to speak like hey, an American. So what, what was the magic bag they had on Harry Potter? I don't know. You're telling the story. Oh, I, I hell, I can't remember. I don't... <laughs> that's, that's what I'm saying. That's kind of what they remind me of. You can just pull just about anything out of those bags. I think I'll use a standard one there. Okay, so this will then be um, op graphite ingot in on request press. And then it should give carbon plate as an out. Carbon. Am I just not seeing it? Yes, I'm just not seeing it. Carbon plate as an out. Yeah, that will probably actually start requesting if you've got things turned on up top. They should be. And that may start straight away. There's some hop graphite ingots in here, actually. Pop a few in. Oh, that should. That came... Huh? I threw some in. Oh, okay. I see. There, you you threw them in the hopper. Okay. No, there should be some going into the hopper. Uh, yeah, no, nope. it'll, it'll in, be inputting. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's automatic. Working. Yep, yep, that's automatic. That's cool. So that's the request one. So it'll just make it when it needs it. Um, hopefully it doesn't overload the backside off it, but it'll make it as it needs it. Um, and then it'll process over here. It is currently just burning through hot graphite dust, which is fine. We're wow. just going to need to make sure we've got more coal coming in. Uh, all right. What was I doing? I was setting up a lab. That's something we've seen many times, so that's not the end of the earth. I will need to do the same sort of deal, though. Uh, all right, so if you've got that heavy plate working, if you want to uh, start... I'm going to go... I'll go check on it, and I will... Give me just a second. Yeah, you start making the, the upgrade to our armor, I guess. I need to make a couple more... These things. Chassis out. Let's make a. Um, uh, no, don't don't do that many. Don't don't do that many at all. Um, crafting. And what do I need? Satellite logistics pipes. Okay, so crafting, and then I'm missing some floor. <laughs> missing a little bit of floor. Seem to have misplaced did some you floor. Pop a big old hole. No, no, I'm just hanging it out over the, over any, you know. Over the top of everything. Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, and one, two. Doing the levitation trick, right? That's it. The amazing magical Minecraft locks. Uh, this will be lab four, I guess. Out. Meta pipes. Do I have more or do I need to go and get more? need to get more but luckily that's just here Oop, stuck on everything um some of them thanks all right so this should get this next lab up and running we'll i'll have to obviously do the the regular prep work for 
Uh, we're going to be using this one and the, the yellow one. Uh, let's do the bag, get the basics out. And then there for now. Uh, right, so let's rename these. This is Lab 4. Call this Lab 4 1. L4 underscore 1, I think it was. There's a dash 1. Let's check. What have I named everything else? I'm trying to keep things. Yes. Aha. L4 1. L2. All right. I'm going to uh, label all this up. We are you know, getting close to the end, but uh, I'll be back in just a moment. Or we'll be back. One tick. All right. So done a bit of tweaking. I've upgraded the assemblers for um, blue, uh, no, for, for red and green science. And then we're waiting on blue science because we have no plastic, which is just how it happens, right? Constantly running out of plastic. I even built this production over here so we could get more plastic and it uh, it doesn't work. So I am going to put an inserter here. I'm going to put a chest here. What, what's happening is that the, the, the naphtha is building up and not allowing, um, not allowing the fluids to flow for the production over there. So if I set this up, like so that'll let us produce the solid fuel using the fluids which will then allow more fluids to flow around and hopefully we'll get more uh, gasoline going into this one to make the plastic etc etc really really need the ender chest because that will fix the railgun issue uh, so i'm definitely going to be pushing towards making the 250 yellow that we require for that uh, that unlock the single singularity infinite storage, even if we don't use it, we might. It uh, apparently if it gets too full, it gets a bit laggy. Um, I will be waiting as much as I can for this one, the digital logistics to be enabled, which will be another I don't know another update. Um, well, we can when we get the chest, we can always do a hoppering system to immediately pull everything out of it. I'm just be happy with the ability to. I can put multiple um, providers onto it and have a stack of each thing we need to transfer between the two bases always on hand. Right. Um, that that's my plan is is to put the buy at least two ender chests. Like just one set would be oh, a yeah. good start, and then that will fix up that that link for the the rail guns. Basically, yeah, it takes out the rail guns and makes and, things and, a little bit more easy. Yeah, and we don't have to reconfigure the entire base. We can just rip those rail guns out and put the ender chests there and be done with it for the moment until we can get yep. refined storage, which is coming. Woo I don't know how much he's going to limit it. Uh, yeah, <laughs> looking at how, mu how many things he left out of um, uh, simple, net uh, simple storage, you know. Yeah, I mean, the, the idea, I don't think it's designed to be a storage system. I think it's... I'm hoping it's just designed to be like a transfer system. A logistics, yeah. And then we can maybe get rid of some of this piping and 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 hope An for the best. Instant, a, a digital instantaneous thing. I'm hoping it leaves fluids in too. Yeah, fluids would be too. awesome. Yeah, fluids would be cool. Because then we can just have everything stored, even if it's in tanks or whatever, but. Instant transfer, no pipes everywhere. Mm -hmm. like uh, wondering storage buffers and such. Wondering what sort of radiation it's going to put out. Anyway, yeah, that's that's well, it's all speculation. How much power is he going to make it use? <laughs> I've got a nuclear generator. It's fine. Yeah, I know. It's like irradiating everything. It's all good. These things are chock a block. Look at that. Oop. Upgrade this one. Come on. Will you upgrade? Hello? Oh, 
Is that just a basic one? Ah, uh, let's level it up. All right, yep. Goodness me. We've got, we've got a bit of, bit of materials here. Uh, I placed down this guy here. <laughs> that helps me a lot with that farm upstairs. So yeah, plastic is, as always, one of our limiting factors. Uh, I've said it before, I don't know how much I want to go into the liquid plastic side of things. Um, it's 100 blue research, but then for liquid plastics... Uh, plastic... Liquid plastic takes methane or naphtha and polyethylene and chlorine and... Yeah, ethylene. That's all the gases. Kind of vent voiding gases at the moment. Oh, yes, we could be using them, but next. <laughs> um, all right, so I think this is probably a good wrapping up point. Um, Chilled was making leather last I checked. Yeah, I'm running out here to see if there's any plastic because that's all I'm lacking. Did you not use the teleporter? No, I forgot all about the portal. <laughs> Oh, no. I'll be using it on the way back, that's for sure. <laughs> the things you forget. Um, I think well, I mean, I haven't logged in in almost a month now, so... I think our Radaway is definitely running now. We're... Did... Or did you void some? No, I didn't void anything. Ex... I... All I did was added those empty tanks on the ethanol line. Because we are down to 140-something buckets from 500. Which is a lot. Which is a big drop. Hmm. So, it, it, it got completely blocked. And, um, that's not what I want. <laughs> it got completely blocked up, so nothing was flowing. Um, so now that we've cleaned up a bit and got the the trains moving again. Um, it's all gone whoosh. It's, yeah, it's all been used up. And we are relying on right away a lot more. These things will be doing their darndest to keep everything clean. Um, but yeah, we're at 168 bucks. So I just moved some of those tanks. This guy, what are you doing? Taking 50 MRADs out. They're doing the job. They're doing the job they need to do. Um, but yeah, still lots to do. I still haven't upgraded that power line from the nuclear reactor. It's not running. So, I don't know how much it puts out when it's not running, but it's not running. Um, and we may need to turn this guy back on eventually. Hmm? Get some more. Is there any, I, are we short on coal? Probably. Hmm. No, it, it just won't have transferred from the guns. From the, well, look in the the gun the guns over there and i didn't see any processed no we have forty six thousand. it's just not making it across you've actually got to empty out the thing on the other end that's what makes it a bit buggy speaking of buggy <laughs> as you get kicked from the server oh did i yep um it's just yeah it's not emptying the the rail guns on the other end well, I... so it won't send the item it also seems Interesting that I get kicked when I'm messing with the railguns. Trying to they look in to their go. inventory. They need to go, right? <laughs> and a chest, here we go. So, yeah, that, that's going to be a focus. We're going to push through that uh, the 250 uh, yellow and unlock that multi-block, wherever it is. What am I looking for? Here it is in logistics. Push through and unlock the, the singularity infinite storage, the 250 yellow. And then, look, we might use that. We might not and then buy the ender chest. So that's our plans. Hopefully we can get it done in between. We've got, you know, kind of three series running now. Uh, so that will put a bit of a dent in it, but um, missing seven blue science. Awesome. Blue science needs plastic. Anyway, mm -hmm. <laughs> maybe take an inventory full of uh, crushed uh, process yeah, cards. Probably a good idea. I'll bring some over. Anyway, wrapping up point. Thank you again, Chilled, for joining me. Uh, You're welcome. Hopefully Anytime. we can fix some of this broken stuff. Um, thanks, everyone, for watching. Please leave your comments down below, as always. 
Hope you enjoyed it, and we will see you in the next one. Bye, everybody. Everybody have a good one.